Hi, welcome to this week's health tip. I'm Dr. Juliet here to keep you out of pain and on the course, brought to you by Conroe Family Chiropractic. Today I want to talk to you about proper hydration and dehydration. In record setting temperatures that we're experiencing in the midst of this drought, it's essential that we stay properly hydrated before we step on the course. Some things that are going to make you more prone to dehydration is if you don't exercise a lot and you step on the course, you're more likely to be dehydrated than other well-tuned athletes. Other things, if you've been sick recently, you're more likely to get dehydrated. Certain medications that you take may dehydrate you even before you step outside of your house. So please, if you're on medications, look at the list of side effects. If dehydration is one of those, make sure you stay properly hydrated even before you step out of your house and into this heat. Now, when you're out there golfing, stay hydrated. Water, water, water. You want to avoid things like Gatorade, Powerade. Those have a lot of sugars in them and not a lot of electrolytes. One of the best form of electrolytes, sodium potassium, is Pedialyte. Now, there's other sports drinks out there you can drink that do have uh, high quantities of sodium potassium, but you want to avoid sugars and corn syrup in those drinks. When you're out there on the course, some signs that you may be getting dehydrated, fatigue, headaches, sweaty palms, abnormal sweaty palms, and even starting to shake. If you notice that when you go to set up that your body's a little more fatigued and you just can't focus and concentrate, these are signs you're dehydrated. No matter where you're at in your game, you need to call it quits for the day and get in the shade and get rehydrated. Again, I'm Dr. Julie here to keep you out of pain and on the course. We'll see you next week.